The Supreme Court ruled unanimously that Donald Trump can remain on the ballot in Colorado, overturning a December decision from the state Supreme Court. The justices in Colorado ruled that the former president is disqualified from a second term because he engaged in insurrection and therefore was barred under Section 3 of the 14th Amendment. It ordered the Colorado Secretary of State to keep him off the 2024 presidential primary ballot. Now, the United States Supreme Court has ruled that the Constitution makes Congress, not the states, responsible for enforcing Section 3 against federal office holders and candidates. The decision states, quote, the text of the 14th Amendment on its face does not affirmatively delegate such a power to the states. The terms of the amendment speak only to enforcement by Congress, which enjoys power to enforce the amendment through legislation. The decision explains that power is given to Congress through Section 5 of the 14th Amendment, which states, the Congress shall have power to enforce by appropriate legislation the provisions of this article. This decision was per curiam, which means it does not have any specific justice listed as the author. It was released in the name of the court. But Justices Barrett, Sotomayor, Kagan, and Jackson wrote concurring opinions. Justices Sotomayor, Kagan, and Jackson wrote that the per curiam decision went too far and didn't stick to the single question that the court was originally asked to answer, which is, did the Colorado Supreme Court err in ordering President Trump be excluded from the 2024 presidential primary ballot? The justices wrote in their concurring opinion, although federal enforcement of Section 3 is in no way at issue, the majority announces novel rules for how that enforcement must operate. It reaches out to decide Section 3 questions not before us and to foreclose future efforts to disqualify a presidential candidate under that provision. The majority announces that a disqualification for insurrection can occur only when Congress enacts a particular kind of legislation pursuant to Section 5 of the 14th Amendment. In doing so, the majority shuts the door on other potential means of federal enforcement. Straight from D.C., I'm Ray Bogan.